Uh, Haji Sahib, we also notice, unfortunately, we are human beings, we make mistakes. People go in these beautiful lands of Makkah al Mukarramah, Rafat, Mina, Muzdalifa, and uh, you know they're busy with the with the with selfies. They're busy in in the in the internet. They're busy talking about worldly things. They're busy uh, worried about, as you mentioned, about the arrangements. What advice do you have for these people? As I said, that try to remember our sins and try to remember that how big sinner I am and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give me chance for this beautiful journey. And also try to realize that may it will be my last chance. May I don't come again or I will die. I don't know because last year in 2022, so many brothers did Hajj, but they are not with us right now. So we don't know that this time we'll, we are here and next time we're not here. So this is the golden chance for us to take maghfirah. Like I used to say that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give you chance that before death and take maghfirah from it, this beautiful journey. And if you are, you know, spending your time with shopping and laughing and talking badly, no, no, we are not here for that. Even in Makkah Park, like after five days or before five days, try to realize that how many hours I spend in Harami Park. Some brothers only going for three, four hours. Where are 20 hours? They're spending in hotel, in restaurant, in shopping center and laughing. No, no, no. We are, we are crying to go to Makkah Park. We are crying to see Kaaba and Musharrafa. We are crying to go for Safa and Marwa. So do as much as you can. Tawaf and Sa'i. Or if you are not able to do Tawaf, you have become tired. Go in front of Kaaba. Just watch Kaaba. If everybody watching Kaaba, the blessing come towards him. Watch Kaaba. Try to make Dua, Tilawat, Zikru Askar. You know, if anybody recites... 70,000 times kalamaya tayyaba la ilaha illallah only if anybody recites according to hadith 70,000 times kalamaya tayyaba inshallah he will get maghfirah from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and if it, it recites in Makkah Allah, 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 Allah. so what my suggestion is take some targets for you that I will recite whole quran Park in Makkah I will recite whole quran Park in Madinah Munawwara I will recite 70,000 times kalamaya tayyaba 70,000 times durud Park and Nawafil and Kazai Omri, take some targets on you. Make busy yourself, the schedule, that I have to do this. How I could get time for mobile and social media and shopping? No, no, no. These all things I can do in my hometown. I am here for Makhfira, I am here for Ibadah. Subhanallah, Subhanallah. Very beautiful point Haji Sahib mentioned that take some targets and this is uh, a norm in our custom, in our in our real life, that when we're working for somebody, we do take some targets. You know, before this before this date, I want to make sure I progress, I complete my targets. So my boss will be impressed. This person will be impressed. So take some targets when you are going there. Complete a Quran, complete two Qurans, complete three Qurans. Recite Duru Sharif, recite Kalma Sharif. There are so 50 many tawaf, things. Inshallah. Subhanallah, fifty tawaf. There are so many things to do. Where do you find the time to search with your phone? People say we are bored, there's nothing else to do. We finish perform Umrah, perform more Umrah. We finish recite Quran, recite more Quran. There are so many things to do. The, everything is based upon your intention and your mindset. Once your mindset becomes correct, everything else will become correct. We love Madani Channel. We love Madani Channel. We love Madani Channel.